don't mind my hair because you know it's a stay at home day it's a snowing outside well it's not snowing but it did snow and um yeah there was a lot going on outside <sighs> what's up y'all welcome back so today i am going to show you a new toy that i got for christmas this is um, from benefit it is the defined and refined brows okay so on the back let me show you what, it's, what it has um, so this is the brow conditioning primer this is the brow pencil precisely my brow and then there's this brow mapping tool right here and then this is the, the high brow so I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how it works well I'm gonna try to because it's gonna be my first time using it. So my cousin got me this cute little kit for Christmas. I'm so excited to use it. So this has this really cute little tin. So you just open it like this. And ta-da! It's got all the fun stuff in there, okay? So this is the brow conditioning primer, the pencil, the mapping tool, and the high brow, which I think is a pencil. So. I'm going to try to look at the uh, directions because I don't really know what I'm doing here. Okay. Oh, it comes with instructions. Okay. So it says tip one. Um, bravo. Bravo. Oh, that's clever. Conditioning primer. Oh, it says there's another trick. It says bonus boost. Wear this nutrient rich formula overnight so it conditions and works its magic while you sleep. Okay, so I'm going to just take my little spoolie and I'm going to get my brows a, a little, I don't know, a little spoolie. Let me come a little closer. Yeah, yeah, don't be shy. Come on in. Bring it in. Okay. This is the conditioning primer. So it looks, I think it is the coolest looking thing ever. Like, look at that. Wait, please try to look at it. Oh, you see that? Isn't that cool? Okay, so we're going to click. One. I don't see nothing yet. Two. I still don't see nothing. Three. Click pin once and wait for gel to appear. Glide over brow. Repeat for other brow. The conditioning formula contains keratin and soy proteins known to help brows look thicker, healthier, and fuller. Prime time. Let the conditioning primer dry completely before applying um, brow makeup. Oh, there it is. So I guess I just kind of, ooh. Ooh, it feels good. It just feels like my brows are wet, that's all. Feels really good. Okay, so I'm gonna click it one time. Another brow. Okay. I don't think that's enough. One more time. Okay, I'm just gonna kind of like let them look ferocious. All right. So um, they're done with that. Tip two, brow mapping tool. Get a precise symmetrical brow shape. Start with the base lined up, um, lined up with the bottom of your nose. Okay. The base, oh, this is the base. Okay. This side, the pointy part is not the base. This part is the base. Lined up with the bottom of your nose. Hold the tool vertically to see where it intersects with your brow. This is, oh my god, y'all, I'm not wearing my glasses, so I can't see. This is your brow head. Mark the top of the brow and the bottom inside your hand. Use the inner edge of the tool when you mark your brows. Keeping, okay, so the second part, keeping the baseline in the same place, tilt the mapping 
tool so it passes through the outside of your pupil. Outside of my pupil, okay. Where it intersects with your brow is your arch or high point. Make two marks at the top and one at the bottom. Okay, so we, we're just gonna focus on one brow because doing two is just stressful for me right now, okay? Okay, all right, so there it says there's a trick. Symmet symmetry. 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 Symmetry is easy. Just make sure the numbers on the mapping tool line up for each brow. Well, I wish I would have read that part first, so I'm going to try it again for the second brow. We're going to see. Alright, so tip three. Fill in the dots. Using short upward strokes, fill in, the, fill in between the marks you made. For a more defined look, use longer horizontal strokes and then fill in one with spoolie brush. Oh, did I get a spoolie? We got a spoolie, y'all. We got a spoolie. That's so exciting. All right, y'all. We're gonna try to fill this in. I think this is gonna be the easy part. I don't know what y'all think. I mean, I haven't, I didn't really fill it in a lot yet. That don't look bad though. That that don't look bad. So let's go back in and like. Y'all, I ran into a door when I was little and so I'll forever have this part in my brow. So I gotta like try to color it in. So then you are supposed to use this highbrow, which is a pencil for my ivory sisters out there. And I'm just going to use it for the sake of the video, so let's see. Oh, it's super creamy. Oh wait, let's read the instructions. It says, tip four, lift your look. Apply highbrow pencil under your brow, following the arch. Lightly blending, this natural looking brow highlighter gives an instantly lifted look to the eye area. So you can see how stark white that is. It does not match my skin tone at all, but let me just see what happens when you blend it out. So. Oh, that brow, it's, <laughs> that highlight, that's just too much. I'm going to go in with this lip pencil, random lip pencil and um, matte concealer. Uh, this is Studio Fix Concealer, Studio Studio Finish Concealer in N40, NW40. I'm going to try to fix this up here. Let's just try to add some color back to I'm still seeing that highlighted glow. I don't like no halo brows, y'all. I don't like halo brows. They're not cute. Don't let nobody tell you that halo brows are cute, because they're not. I don't even know if I want to do the other side right now. So as you can see, this is how I, this is the look I came up with, with the, um, use, following the instructions, using the mapping tool and all that stuff. Now on this side, I'm gonna show you how I would work it without all that stuff. So let's get it popping. Oh, y'all, I like my brow. 
like this one too, but I like this one a lot more. This thing is bomb. Bomb, 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 bomb. If you could figure out how to work the brow mapping tool, I think it'll really help you. Um, if you are new to like filling in your brows, it may be able to help you out. It may make it a little easier. So you can like make sure your brows are symmetric and they're not asymmetric. <laughs> I'm so corny. Anyways. Anyways, I like I like this thing. It's pretty cool. And um, I've been using Anastasia Beverly Hills uh, brow products for like forever now they're actually the only brow products I've ever used besides like um, drugstore brow pencils like wet n wild pencil so this it was nice to see that there are other brow products out there that are just as bomb or even better than Anastasia Beverly Hills um, I don't know if this was just a special thing like a holiday gift set of the entire set but I do know you could purchase these individually. Well, the primer and the, the pencil and all that. But I'll link it down in my description box. So make sure you check that out. Please thumbs up the video. Let, tell me which brow you like better. You like the one I use with the brow mapping thing? Or you like um, brow A right here? Or do you like brow B? A or B? A or B so just let me know um, I just thought I'd just come on here and show you my first impressions and thoughts with this and um, I'll see you in my next video bye, bye.